Hello guys, Luce here. Welcome back to another video and this is a huge one. This is uh, just a quick video about the big news. Alphas are out of the FIFA 22 Reels mod, the full version. Obviously, if you uh, missed it, I released the light version of the mod about a month ago. Link is in the description to that. It contains licenses for the uh, unlicensed teams and fixes for the youth uh, skinny arms and missing numbers issues, which is a really good kind of placeholder until you have the full mod, which alphas are out of now. Uh, they are not complete, obviously a few things are missing, no gameplay, no turf, no camera, no add-ons, but you have the core reels mod, which has realistic transfers, youth scouting, player growth, player values, uh, board, uh, everything, like a ton of things, just as complete as the FIFA 21 mod, basically, in that sense, uh, the core reels mod, uh, and also contains a few, uh, major improvements to certain things, like youth scouting, uh, like transfers, like player growth, but then you have something like face updates, which improves almost 300 uh, player faces, I think, with some big names. Players like Mason Mount, Theo Hernandez, uh, Trent Alexander-Arnold, Ousmane Dembele, Federico Valverde, Dan Juma, Lorenzo Pellegrini, Vinicius Jr., Ospina, Tonali, Camavinga, uh, you know, Taglifico, Rafinha, Payet, Militao, uh, Pepe, Tierney, De Jong, Pulisic, uh, Neves, Barella, Milikin, Savic, Sané, uh, you know, a huge amount of players. Uh, but then you also have new faces, and this includes faces for pretty much every uh, player with a big potential. Uh, tons, hundreds and hundreds of these. If you go here, all of these players now have real faces. Your Pedris, your Koundes, your Magnans, your Nuno Mendes, you know, Tapsoba, but literally everyone. Bastoni, Kakai, Doku, Harvey Elliott, Almo, uh, Poro, Smithrow, you know, uh, you know, uh, Romero, literally so many players. Gavi too, big player now. So tons of faces. They are all much higher quality for, for everything in the mod. They are much higher quality than the FIFA 21 mod. There's no more Lewis scripts. It's all automatically applied. It's so easy to use. And then you also have manager faces. This includes the newly appointed uh, Ralph Ragnick, but also obviously Antonio Conte, Tuchel, Xavi, Luciano Spalletti, Allegri, uh, you know, uh, Thomas Frank, Ruben and Rim, uh, you know, updates for Klopp, but new faces for tons of managers. Nagelsmann obviously has one, so does Gallardo and uh, Flick. And yeah, just a huge amount of manager faces. And again, most of them are higher quality than the FIFA 21 mod, all automatically applied, stuff like that. Truly amazing stuff. You also have referee faces, uh, which I think are an underrated feature, you know, for your Mike Deans, for your Matteo Lajoses, uh, that's great. Um, but of course, you can't also forget the tattoos. I mean, almost 200 tattoos, I believe, in the first alpha, which is a huge amount. And this includes players like DePaul, Di Maria, Fred, Gabrielle. Hoiberg, Insigne, etc, etc. But then of course the main graphics mod, this includes uh, obviously your licenses for unlicensed teams, but also a bunch of trophies, league logo updates, kits for uh, fake, uh, for generic GK kits, for like uh, the Portuguese league, the uh, two, the EFL League 1, EFL League 2, a few other leagues, real banners, flags, and scarves for, for pretty much every team. Very underrated feature. I think it really improves the game so much, just graphically. Also a secret feature that I won't say here, but if you do uh, become an alpha tester, you will get it. It is super cool in my opinion. And yeah, if you do want to become an alpha tester, you want to go to patreon.com slash reelsmod and join the alpha tester tier here. You can save 10% if you pay annually. Before you join, it will go over when you get charged, how all that works, but it's pretty simple. And yeah, again, uh, this is totally optional. The mod will be free in public soon enough. Soon it will go to beta testing and then early access and then it will be free. But if you do want to sign up to the alpha tester, you can play with the mod today, right now. Um, and you also get to support the mod hugely, especially in this time. We're throwing everything we have at this mod. It's going to be so much better than the FIFA 21 mod. It's truly going to be the best FIFA mod ever made, and I truly believe that. So from the bottom of my heart, if you sign up, I truly thank you. Uh, but there's also other tiers here, etc., etc. You can get some really cool perks. But of course, you can wait for it to go to beta or just wait for it to be publicly released. Whatever. It's all totally fine. But if you do choose to sign up and support the mod truly thank you um but yeah that is pretty simple if you do sign up you want to link your discord to your patreon it's all explained in this post and then join the discord server and go here very simple to download very simple to install much easier than the fifa 21 mod because everything is applied automatically the mod manager is easier to use etc etc 
Um, yeah, this is truly a really great thing. A big milestone is the alphas being released, betas will come soon, then full release. Again, not fully complete, no gameplay, that will be in uh, the next alpha or maybe the one after that coming very soon, and there will also be dedicated uh, gameplay alphas in a separate tier. Uh, and yeah, everything uh, else will be coming very, very soon, but I wanted to get something out right now so people can test stuff, people can get their hands on it, and it improves the game so, so much. Soon I'll do some like kind of reveals and maybe teases of alpha content. But yeah, until then, uh, if you do sign up, I really thank you. Link is in the description. Uh, and yeah, see you guys. Have a fantastic day. And I'll see you guys next one. Goodbye. I've been running out of time. Think I need a rewind. Feeling out of life. I put everything aside. Hoping that I make it right. All the things I do for you.